deadly peril, a submarine in narrow or shallow waters. Being difficult to detect, it may attack your ships operating in the area or moored there. It may attack a harbor or a supply depot, or lay mines or just collect information for a later attack. Such behavior is typical of a new trend in submarine operations. Even if the submarine were detected, it might very well escape, since no anti-submarine weapons have been designed for this situation, or are rapid and efficient enough, cost-effective and versatile enough to be used on all types of ships and vessels. But now, an adequate weapon does exist, the Saab ASW-601 from Saab Dynamics. A cost-effective system, indispensable if you want your naval defense to be complete. Saab ASW-601 is a standalone multi-grenade launching system. It's rapid, efficient, and versatile. Its shaped charges will penetrate any submarine, in and out, causing lethal damage. With the Saab ASW-601, you've changed the situation to your advantage. The submarine is there. It'll not be permitted to escape. The ASW-601 system is alerted. Its fire control system receives data from the ship's information system and locks onto the target. It continuously optimizes the elevation and training of the launchers. It evaluates hit probability and recommends salvo size and grenade pattern. The required hit probability is obtained now. Launchers are chosen. Fire. The ASW-601 pack of 36 grenades rains into the pre-selected area. They're armed when they strike the water, and they sink silently, inexorably, towards the target. One hit will do. One grenade out of 36. One falls against the hull. And now look, it turns towards the hull. This single hit will sink the submarine. No one in that section has survived. Water pours in. The submarine is neutralized forever and the launchers are prepared for a next salvo, just in case. Now let's see what makes the Saab ASW-601 not only rapid and efficient, but also cost-effective and indeed versatile. So versatile that some interesting applications haven't even been mentioned yet. We'll return to them later. The grenades are easy to handle and load. No preparation is needed before firing. The fins stabilize its flight and are automatically turned up when the grenade is fired. The grenade has a shaped charge, which is extremely efficient. For maximum effect, the grenade places itself perpendicularly to the submarine's outer hull by means of a latching mechanism, which is surprisingly simple and therefore very reliable. When a grenade strikes the water, its nose cap is lost and a sharp latching ring with damper is exposed. The center of gravity is close to the latching ring, so when the grenade strikes the submarine hull, it'll tip. If the submarine is moving, the latching ring rotates so that the grenade moves a short distance relative to the hull until it's perpendicular to it. To prove efficiency, this test was arranged to closely simulate underwater conditions and the two hulls of a submarine. A submersed grenade. Stainless steel, 5 millimeters. That's the outer hull. Water. 1,000 millimeters. Stainless steel, 35 millimeters. That's the inner hull, plus an air core, plus stainless steel, 80 millimeters, to measure the rest effect. And this hole was made in the 35 millimeters steel plate. Inside a submarine section, the pressure shock would kill everybody. Grenades that miss the submarine will detonate a little later, and therefore cause no problems in the future. Of course, the grenades won't reach the target without the entire ASW-601 system, consisting of three main parts of equipment. The on-deck equipment is dominated by two platforms, each with two launchers carrying nine grenades each, 36 grenades in all. The platforms are trainable both in yaw and pitch. They're small and can easily be mounted on any vessel or ship 
small or large. The 36 grenades may be fired one by one in about five seconds. The firing range is approximately 150 to 450 meters with an azimuth angle of plus minus 110 degrees. The grenades are operating from just below the surface down to approximately 500 meters, which makes the Saab ASW-601 into an efficient weapon also in blue water. Complete reloading is done in only two to three minutes. The below deck equipment mainly comprises hydraulic and electric power supplies and control units. They're easily installed wherever there's space available. The fire control is normally located in the ship's combat information center and comprises a graphics display unit presenting, for instance, the position of the submarine, the suggested number of grenades, the grenade pattern, and hit probability. A text display unit presents basic data such as the ship's speed, pitch, and roll angles compass data, and so on. Finally, there's a keyboard for entering data, a pointing device, and a fire control unit. Safety switches, locks, and special controls make the ASW-601 a safe system to operate. It can easily be adapted to any specific safety regulations. Although the ASW-601 is a standalone system, it naturally needs target data, from a sonar, for instance. Again, its versatility makes it easy to connect to the ship's C3I system, which may be an analog one, a data link system, a local area data network, or any other of today's C3I systems. The Saab ASW601 even offers you additional applications, underlining its versatility and corresponding cost-effectiveness. For example, the ASW601 can be used in fixed installations. And the grenades can also be used in the helicopter launcher system ASW-604. Everywhere rapid and efficient. And its range of applications extends even further. Yes, the ASW-601 is actually a dual purpose system. Because once you have the ASW-601 on board, it can be used for countermeasure purposes using IR ammunition or chaff ammunition manufactured by Saab Dynamics and providing excellent protection for small and medium-sized vessels against radar and IR homing missiles. To conclude, your naval defense system doesn't have to be dangerously incomplete anymore. Just let the ASW-601 system from Saab Dynamics complete it. The cost-effective Saab ASW-601 is rapid, efficient, and versatile. It is a well-designed tool that does justice to your tactical skill.